Walkmans! We're mixing it up on you again. Okay. You're not watching a video. Oh no. I'm so scared. You're reacting to this. Oh, my phone! Oh, what is this thing? I have no idea what it is. What is this? I don't get what it is. What do I do? Press play? I don't know what it does. Question time! So, do you know what that is used for? Walkie talkie. <coughs> Speaking into it. <coughs> Music, a boombox. <coughs> wait, wait, wait. It's a cassette player, right? It actually is a device that plays music. Oh. Oh. So maybe we'll play music today? Oh, here. Radio, AM, FM. Stop, play, okay. What are you talking about? You gotta be kidding me. But how does it work? We need to find on. Oh, wait, I see. Wait, what? Uh, where is the, where is the, where is the toy? <laughs> I'm so, I feel so judged right now. <gasps> I did it! I don't hear any music. I don't know what to do now. You open it, put the cassette inside, close it, and then you press play. You actually need something else to get it to work. Oh, come on, that's, that's cheap. Really, guys? Cassette? Yes! Yes! You actually need a cassette. A what? Do you know what a cassette is? No. 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 So we have a cassette. I've uh, never seen this. Ah! Ooh, are these like in the movies? So now how does it work? How do you do this? I know I have to open it. <laughs> nope. How do you put it in? I am not going to give up. I'm a survivor. <laughs> okay, I give up. Do you open the front? Yes. Yes. Oh, I feel like I'm Indiana Jones or something. So right here on either side, you grab on either side and whoop. What? And now you do it. Oh, uh, that was simple. You guys could have told me earlier. Which way does it go? <laughs> now which way does it go? Ugh. It's so hard. Push it all the way in. Nothing happens. What do you need? You, uh, need... I'm not sure what you need. How do you hear the music? <laughs> I don't know. Do I need to turn up the volume? On these devices, you need headphones or you can't hear anything. Uh, I think that's kind of strange. This is, like, horrible. That's the... Worst thing. Oh, this is a rip off because you you want to listen, but you can't because you don't have any headphones. Hand over the headphones. <laughs> so we have some headphones for you. Oh, my grandpa has these. I used to have a pair of these. Oh my god. I'm such a 90s kid, but I wasn't born in the 90s. It works. It's working. I feel so accomplished. What song is this? Better be good. Um. What is this old time music? What do you think of the process? This thing takes forever. Too complicated. I feel so like lazy saying this. You have to actually do stuff. This. Slimming, isn't it? You need headphones just to listen to music? Do you know how messed up that is? Actually, it wouldn't take so long because on the iPad, you have to go into the internet, find Pandora, you have to click that thing, you have to make it play, you know? If you had like 20 songs and you wanted to go to song number six, how would you do that? You would have to hit the, the next thing, right? No? The back button and the start button? And rewind and go, this feels about right. Play it. It's not there. Okay, keep going, keep going. You'd have to hit the fast forward and wait for it to go past all the other songs. So you have to guess and stop it and listen and be like, nope, still not the song. Whoa. Oh my gosh. I would not want to do that. I could not imagine living in your guys' days with this. So today you can fit thousands of songs on a phone, but on a cassette you can only fit up to about 30 songs. I feel bad for the people in the 90s. I really do. <laughs> 
What are you thinking about now? I'm thinking about how many tapes you would need. So this is called a portable cassette player. And when this came out in the 1980s, it was the biggest thing. Does that surprise you? Yes. No, because it's just like having a computer or iPhone. It just amazes me how technology has changed. I could just imagine you guys, like 13 year olds, just like, thug life represent. <laughs> OMG, do you have a cassette and a portable music player? Oh, OMG, I have one too. <laughs> in the 1980s, it was like, whoa, something that can play music and I can carry it around in my if I have a large pocket. When these were brand new, they cost $200. No. Why? This seems like a bit of an outrage. For this thing. I'll actually pay for it. It's nice. Just not that. a lot. Not a lot? Just the, just An the... iPad cost $700. When they came out, it was pretty much the first time music was, was something... invented. No. <laughs> No, not invented. It was like the first time music was easily portable. So people would go running even with this. With uh, these with... things on. You can't run with this. Your arm would be like this by the end. <sighs> Ooh, this is really heavy. I will be like, oh, oh my god. <laughs> what if it falls out? Oh no, my $200 twice. So now that you've learned all about this old technology, what do you prefer? The technology of today for music or this? Technology today. Easy question. I prefer technology up to date. This is a lot better because you won't break your phone. I take this in a heartbeat now. <laughs> I want my phone. My iPhone, this is so hard and complicated. My technology. Thanks for watching another episode of Kids React. Let us know in the comments what yucky old stuff we have to react to next. If you used to have one of these, how would you ever live with this thing? This thing is so boring. Wish me luck, guys. I'm going on a run.